Hey guys, what's going on? Tenebris here. How are you guys doing? Welcome back to the channel. So today we're going to be talking about some massive developments to, uh, relating to Hypixel's anti-cheat, kind of summarize and recap some of the stuff I talked about in my previous video, and talk about what I think is the best option for Hypixel in the future and all this stuff. So pretty much, let's explain what happened. So first of all, I made a video, uh, you know, a few days ago, and this video was basically comparing Hypixel's Watchdog to my Min Club's anti-cheat, anti-gaming chair. Now, a lot of people who watch this video had a lot of issues with it, but yeah, in a future video, I'm gonna go over all of those, and some of the criticism was valid while some of it wasn't, but yeah, basically, I'm bringing this up because I was pretty much showing I what I believe to be the major weakness of Watchdog and why Watchdog, you know, pales in comparison in terms of detecting blatant cheats to something like Anti-Gaming Chair, which is actually also very good at detecting closet cheats, which I'm not going to show on video, obviously, but it is very good at doing that as well. Um, so earlier today, I went on and I decided to play some Skywars for some reason. And, you know, it was 9 a.m., so I guess not many staff were on. But, yeah, I encountered two B-Hoppers using Kill Aura, one guy using 5-Block Reach, one guy using 0% velocity in the span of 14 Skywars games. Like, that is ridiculous. That is an insane number of cheaters. I reported them all and everything, but seriously. that I mean, people who are using 0 knockback, I mean, they shouldn't last more than a game. I mean, you're taking no knockback. I mean, there has to be a way, there is a way to check that on the server side, and you're not going to get false bans with it, as long as you, you know, check the player's not lagging, etc., etc., all this stuff. Uh, there's not really any way to, you know, explain that away. I don't understand how you can have a server with players using no knockback. I just don't understand. But, yeah, I'm getting a little off topic. Basically, I encountered this and I tweeted out all this stuff. It got a bunch of support and everything. Um, and then, like, a few minutes later, I actually came across this tweet by Simon Hypixel, the Hypixel owner, and it reads as follows. So, Simon says, I'll be opening a lot of job positions in early 2020 for the Hypixel MC server to support more update anti-cheat improvements, new features, and much more. I mean, the server went from 25k peak to 90k, and we didn't grow the team. It's been quite challenging. And then he follows this up with, in the short term, we'll be posting a few critical roles, especially in the anti-cheat and legal department, as we are seeing more and more hacked clients are becoming growing quote-unquote businesses that focus entirely on our server. So yeah, this is a very good step in the right direction. I applaud Simon for this. This is excellent. This is actually exactly why I was making the videos on Watchdog. Like, I don't just hate on Hypixel for no reason. I think that they can fix their crap. I'm not saying that, you know, everything's going to be perfect and they're going to immediately do it, but I'm just saying that I think that what Simon's saying here and what he's striding to do is good. But we're going to kind of dissect this tweet really quickly. So he basically starts off by saying he's going to hire more people to work on the anti-cheat, which is nice, but we really need people who are really competent and know the game inside and out. So Simon, you need to really vet your people that you're going to be hiring. Vet them really hard. I know you do, but like really, really hard because we need people who know how Minecraft works inside and out to make a good anti-cheat. That's just the truth of the matter. You need someone like that to make a good anti-cheat. And in addition to that, he follows that up with saying that he's going to get more people in the legal department for these hacked client developers making a business off of their server. Now, I don't know if you guys are completely aware of this, but there have been instances of Hypixel going after, you know, YouTubers legally and pretty much trying to, like, shut them down, like, hacking YouTubers and stuff. But yeah, he basically says that he is planning on suing hacked client developers. Now, you might say that that's stupid. Obviously, he can't do that. But, I mean, I mean, Hypixel is a huge company. They can kind of bully anyone that they really want to, especially if they're, you know, literally taking away their profit. Like, hacked client developers are literally taking away their profit. So they could easily, you know, storm through and shut down all of these, you know, it, especially if they're made for high pixel and they have high pixel only bypasses but yeah i think that's really interesting that they're going or they're planning on shutting down a lot of these hacked clients and i really hope that they do the same thing with alt shops because those are like literally the worst i mean people have virtually infinite accounts but what's important here is that this is not going to necessarily end cheating. This is not really going to affect a lot of hacked client developers, especially because a lot of them are under the radar and Hypixel is not necessarily going to know about them. And obviously there's going to be uh, some that are going get, to get away with this, but 
Obviously, I like the ambition. I like what he's saying here. But is it really going to come to fruition like 100%? I don't necessarily think so. So yeah, overall, I'm pretty skeptical of Simon's tweet uh, in a way where I think that uh, he, his mind and what he's trying to do is in the right place. I just don't know if they're going to pull it off in the way that I think will be the best in the future. Now, in the future, I do think that Hypixel is going to, you know, improve their server-side anti-cheat quite a bit. I think Watchdog is going to get better, especially with, you know, more and more people noticing that Watchdog isn't as good as it could be and all this stuff. And I know it's been an issue for the longest time. I've talked about it for literally the longest time. But now it's, it's getting to the point where all these smaller servers have better anti-cheats and everything. So yeah, I'm pretty much skeptical, but I'm hopeful that, you know, Hypixel will pull through and make a really good server-side anti-cheat. But I do still think that they should implement a client-side anti-cheat for competitive game modes. I'm still, I'm always going to have that opinion. And it, I, I, I've made arguments for this in the past on other videos, and I might link to them but down below. But, you know, pretty much... I think Clyde's and anti cheats are the solution for competitive game modes, but for casual ones, yes, Watchdog hopefully will get an upgrade soon. So yeah, I'm really glad to see this development, and let me know what you guys think about this whole situation about my video last week, you know, Hi uh, Hypixel potentially suing hack client developers, getting them shut down, uh, you know, hiring more devs, improving Watchdog. What do you guys think is going to happen? Do you guys think it's going to be improved, or do you guys not think so? Uh, let me know what you guys think about that in the comment section down below, and I'll see you guys later. Peace out.